what's up guys so hope everybody's having a great night um i have not done a video in a while and i have a big box that's been sitting here because i've wanted to do this video for like days now but i just never seem to have time so i decided that i would just hurry up and do it tonight because i want to see what's in this box because i forget what i got so i figured i'd do it with you guys because you guys seem to like unboxing videos so here we go other than I mean, really, Sensi? Is this necessary? What's up, it? Okay. So. Oops. All right, let's start thing. Okay. First up, the gnome. Oh, yeah, this is all my Christmas stuff. Question. All right. Oh, he is so kind. So he's metal. He's a metal guy. Oh, well, it's tucky down. Hold on, people. I think I just changed the color of the damn light too. Let's push back. Okay. Alright, so he's metal. Sorry, I'm sending a blanket. He comes with a glass dish. And remember, the glass dish will tell you how many cubes. I don't know if you guys can see that, but right there, this one says four. I usually only use two. Like always, they come with a bulb. Don't forget, too, that in your Halloween and in your Christmas warmers, you guys can um, buy $2 color changing bulbs. Um, I think there is red, orange, green, purple, blue, and yellow. I think. I don't know. But, alright. He's so cute, you guys. Look at his little head. Alright. So, this is what he looks like in real life. And then when you turn him on, these little snowflakes project onto the wall. So he's super cute. The back of it's open, of course, to let the scent out. And then that's what he looks like. Is he so cute? I love him. I'm obsessed with gnomes. So there you go, David the gnome. He's metal with a glass dish. And... Let me see. I don't know if it tells me on the box to see what wattage is. 20 watts. So you would use a 20 watt um, light bulb with him. So he's super cute. I'll just put him back in here. I won't rebox them while y'all are sitting here trying to see what else is in the box. I remember that this goes in upside down before I'm freaking out on why the heck it won't fit inside the box. Okay, so there's that one. And then festive fur Christmas tree one. So I think that these guys were 65 on the website. Now remember, if you have a party and you earn enough rewards, then you guys can get half off items. So this is really 
really gonna annoy me. So then he wouldn't be 65, he would be, what? I don't know math, 30, 32, 50 maybe, is that right? I don't know. Don't judge me, okay? So, this is also a metal. Don't forget, you can also change your colored bulbs with these. Red or green would be super pretty. And this one looks like a 25 water metal. It's like um, a brushed gold and white. Oh, you guys, this is so freaking out. Again, glass dish, number four on there. Their recommended amount of wax cubes is four. I use two, but I also literally have, I am not shitting you, probably 20 warmers in my house going at the same time because, well, because I'm crazy, I guess. <gasps> you guys, what? Look how freaking cute. Should I put the bulb in and light it up real quick? Hold on, let's check it out. Let's check it out. Come on. Thank you. Back it up. I'm doing it on the floor because I couldn't lift this big old box up on the dang thing. Because of my freaking back. Which I'm sure once I get off the floor is gonna hurt anyway. So there's that. Yay. Alright, let's plug her in. And there she is. Look how cute. her and actually it looks like the wire goes through that little hole right there so it would be plugged in like this you guys how stinking cute are you serious right now I love that I love it I don't know if I said it but this is metal too and yes 25 watt light bulb for this so that's also still on the website um, if you want to check it out, Blink. all right, I think I have a colored bulb actually, Hailed on, I'll be right back, don't judge my messy office. Water. Uh, this is a green one. Let's check it out. Because really, a colored bulb can change an entire look of the warmer. Like I put a purple one in my um. I call it my Hocus Pocus warmer. It's not Hocus Pocus. It's the Book of Spells or whatever the heck that one's called. I can't think of it. Right. I think it's, oh, Under My Spell, I think is what it's called. See, these bulbs are only two bucks, no matter what size you get. You just want to make sure that you use the correct wattage bulb for the warmer because if you use one that is um too large of a wattage and you turn it on then your wax is going to get um extremely hotter than it should and your smell is going to burn off faster and if you use one that is lower than what it calls for then your wax is not going to melt so i know it doesn't seem like it would be that big of a deal but it really truly is <clears throat> all right let's turn it on What? Why isn't it turning on now? Do I not have it? Oh, because I had it 
twisted in. Crooked. What in the heck? I'm going to be one ticked beyond. Oh, for Pete's sake. Well, Sensi, you got some splaining to do. Okay, well, this is it with a red bulb instead of a green. See, here, let me shut the light off. Oh. Look how pretty. See, so it just changes the look of it a little bit. I really wish the green one would have worked though. But, okay, so that one is the festive fur is what that one is called. So let's put this over here, over there. I am so annoyed that this green one doesn't work. It doesn't look blown. never give up because you never know oh I like the green way better than the red I think that looks super super cool yep you're gonna get the green bulb so that's the green the red like I said they have purple purple orange I think orange yellow blue I, don't know. I know they have all the Hogwarts colors so Red, yellow, green, blue. And then they have orange and purple. I know that. Why do I have so many dang green balls? That's weird. Hmm. Whatever. Anyways. So yeah, that um is super cute. I forget how this goes back in there. I'll figure it out later. Alright, let me turn this light back on. <clears throat> um, and I also like to suggest too that um, when you place another order or a order um, that you add some of your bulbs to your cart so that way if they blow then you have some on hand. Um, I know my sister Stephanie, she said that she's had a warmer for years and her bulb, and she leaves it on all the time. And, uh, she said that she hasn't had to change the bulb yet, which is kind of crazy. But, I mean, I've had a couple of warmers that I haven't had to change the bulb. I almost feel like the 25 watts go out quicker than the 15 or the 20. Um, but... I, and then um, they're two dollars a piece, or else you can buy three packs for five bucks. So, like this, and then you'll get three of them in a pack. Yeah. So that's that. This goes off there. Oh no. Just kidding. I gave them this one. I'm 
always forget how these dang things go in here. Put one there, and then we'll figure you out later, I guess. All right, let's see what else I got in this box. you guys this before too um make sure you guys save your boxes um because you never know when you're gonna want to um maybe sell your warmers to upgrade to new ones or if you're gonna move or you know what it could be and you're gonna want to have that box so what i do is i just have this closet <laughs> literally full of sunsea um and i just put all my boxes in there i don't fold them down i keep them um built and put together and then when seasons change i just switch them back and forth because there's only so many places that you can put freaking warmers and i have a lot like a lot all right, and then here is another one, another Christmas tree. This one is Trim the Tree. This one was also $65, I believe. And, okay, okay, hold on. So this goes in here like this, and where uh -huh. and this it's shoved in here like this perfect i never would have figured that out not even gonna lie not even gonna try and act like that i would have figured that out because i absolutely would not have get this ball down because i don't want to crush it And then it goes on top like that. And then this. Well, son of a. Whatever. I swear to God, it takes forever to put these things back in there because I can never remember how the heck they go. Oh, my goodness. Oh, yeah, the bulb goes up the treetop. Okay. <laughs> So we got to shove the bulb up in the tree top. You guys, this one is so pretty too. Come home and make some Okay, so this one, trim the tree. Oh my gosh, look how cute this is. This is also like a brushed gold and a white, so literally goes with pretty much any type of Christmas decoration, and super duper cute. Ball goes in there. Again, you can change up the um, color of the bulbs if you want to. I'm not gonna plug this one in. And yeah, this is super cute. I really like it. <laughs> I really like it, y'all. Shove the bulb in the top and shove this in there as well. And then this goes on like this. And then this goes like that. And then it goes in here like so. And then clearly they had an issue getting the top on too. <laughs> so I don't feel so bad. 
Bam! I got that one. Yes. Alright, so trim the tree. That one was really pretty. I don't know what one I like better. They kind of... I mean, they're both kind of similar. That one gives a more... I don't know, like a... I would walk into like a mansion and see a decoration or something. I don't know. <laughs> All right, what else do I got here? One more warmer. And this one is the Christmas camper. This one is a 25 Wada. So, I got the summer camper, or I guess the. There we go. I guess it would be like the 4th of July camper. Oh, and I really, really liked it. So, look at this. And um, I've heard news that the um, old style truck element warmer is coming back. And a lot of people will put them together. So, they'll put the truck pulling the Christmas camper. And it is. So, I'll keep you updated on that too. Okay, seriously, are you joking? This is so cute. I love it. It has um, a square dish. Definitely comes with a bulb, like always. This one says for, um, I thought there was a scratch on there. We was about to have an issue. We all good though. Oh, it's freaking hot glue. So you got the little wreath, and then you got the little Christmas lights that go around. Another one, another wreath. And you got the little hitch on the back, the wheels. This is super cute, you guys. Little door. Super cute, super cute. I forget how much this one was, to be quite honest. Um, yeah, I forget. But um, you can get all of these um, these warmers on the website, and you would go to the menu button and then click on collections and then click on holiday collection, and you can get them right there. in each of my kids rooms because I wanted the room to smell good but I also did not want wax in their room because they're boys and yeah you get it Ooh, swirling snowflakes it actually smells really really good I don't know what snowflakes smell like but I guess the snowflakes had a smell it could be this it's uh, not super strong, mild, it's really good, I like it. Uh, very snowy spruce. Now, I um, am obsessed with the smell of Christmas trees. Like, I love it. And Joshua hates it. So, he's just going to have to deal with it. Oh my god, it smells so good! You guys, seriously, if you love the smell of Christmas, walking through the Christmas trees and that snowy spruce smell, dude, I'm in for real. You guys, the smell. <laughs> Honestly, I might <laughs> keep it at my desk and just sniff it every so often. If I could like rub it on my skin, I probably would, but 
Mm. Oh, maybe I could rub it on my skin when I'm mad at Josh, so he'll leave me alone since he hates the smell. <laughs> oh my god, very snowy spruce. I'm about to jump on and like grab all of those because that smells like Christmas. Um, caramel apple craze. If you haven't tried caramel apple craze, you are crazy. Literally smells like a freaking orchard. So from a Christmas tree farm to a pumpkin farm. Well, no, it doesn't smell like pumpkins at all. It smells like when you walk inside where all the fudge and the caramel apples and... Oh, it smells like a caramel apple. You get hints of like apple and then... A light hint of caramel and it's delicious. Caramel apple craze. I swear to God, that very snowy spruce is freaking on point. Farm stand pumpkin. So it's like I'm getting hints of cinnamon, perhaps, and pumpkin. Mmm. Yeah, that's what I feel it smells like. It smells good. Definitely very fall. Uh, farm stand pumpkin. And um, I also bought a mystery man. These are on clearance, but my kids love the mystery man smell for their rooms. So I got that, and I also got two Amazon rain because they also love that. Amazon rain. Um... Reminds me of like a really clean, fresh smell. Perhaps, maybe, if you were in the Amazon and it rained. I mean, I don't know. I've never been there, so. But yeah, Amazon rain, that's a good one. Um, I use this in a fragrance flower, too, in my office. And every time I walked in here, I could smell it. And that was before I had any warmers in here. Um... And then once that one was gone, I put a hibiscus pineapple fragrance flower in here and it did not nearly smell as strong. So um, this fragrance is good for large or small rooms. All right. And let's see what else I got in here. Wax. 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 Can't have Scentsy if you don't have wax, right? I mean, yeah, we can use pods, but I mean, essentially at some point you'll have to use some wax. So Scarlet Sunflower, um, if you got one of my Hocus Pocus crates, then this was in there. Um, it represented Sarah. And it smells really, really good. I wasn't sure if I was going to like it or not, but it's almost like a um fresh smell to me but it's really 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 good it's kind of a lighter smell so it probably um would be good for like small bathrooms smaller offices bedrooms things like that um <laughs> i got a very snowy spruce wax bar I swear to god I'm literally about to get on and order all the snowy spruce. Like, I am not kidding you. I know you're probably sick of hearing me it, say it. Oh my gosh, it smells like a Christmas tree. And, oh, I had to get this. So I think I got four of these. Um, The warm pumpkin drizzle. Everybody was making such a fuss about the scent of the month. Um, warm pumpkin drizzle that I had to grab some. What? Like, okay. So picture, like you're at your grandma's house or something, and she's making like some pumpkin bread or pumpkin rolls, and then she makes the frosting and drizzles it over the pumpkin, whatever she made. Wow. You guys, this is really good. If you like a, um, like a, uh, pumpkin roll or like a, 
bakery, pumpkin-y, fall smell, you should get this. Wow, that smells really, really, really good. Maybe I'll send some samples out. If you want some samples, let me know. Uh, car caramel apple craze because my family loves caramel apple craze and Johnny Appleseed together because it smells like a caramel apple and like an apple orchard or, or you know the inside like I said before Johnny Appleseed Johnny Appleseed Johnny Appleseed smells really really good um it's like it smells like an apple like a I don't want to say like a Macintosh apple, but I mean, think of how you think a apple smells and that's probably how this smells. Maybe like a green apple, but it's red. I mean, the wax is red. It smells really, really good, guys. And caramel apple craze, which we already smelled. We already know what that smells like. And then also I got Harvest Blessings. This is one of my very favorite smells. If you love fall smells and you want your whole house to smell like freaking fall, get you some Harvest Blessings because this stuff is on point. Oh, so good. So yeah, I guess that's all of it. So all of this stuff I got, um, so every month, um, I basically have to open up a shopping link and then, um, I put all the orders through my shopping link for whoever wants to place an order uh, that month. So it's a shopping link or a party link. Um, and then at the end, I use the rewards to get stock, um, order things for like giveaways, um, you know, whatever I might need. So I got four warmers. I got seven pods and three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen. Um, oh snap. And fifteen things of wax. And I want to say I paid $131. Um, that's because I had enough, um, not, I had four half off items I could use and then I also had um, over $100 in Scentsy spending money. So the Scentsy spending money can be used on any Scentsy item other than you can't use it on clearance and I don't think you can use it on Disney. So um, if you're interested to host a party, you can either do one in person or on Facebook. I highly recommend it because you can get a bunch of good stuff like this for cheap. Um, and if you don't want to, then I still appreciate you being on my page and I appreciate all your guys' support. I love doing the Scentsy stuff. I love being able to be creative and, um, try to create mystery bags and the scent crates and stuff for you guys and make them as fun as I can. So thank you so, so much. I appreciate every single one of you. I know I say that all the time and it might sound like it's being repeated, but I just want you guys to know that I truly do appreciate you guys. So, um, yeah. That's it. I just wanted to get through that, but I have to go to bed now because, well, after I put these freaking warmers back in the boxes, if I can get them in there. Um, and then I gotta go to bed because I have to be an adult and go to work tomorrow. Real work. I wish I could just do Sunsy all day long. <laughs> but that doesn't pay the bills. So. Anyways, um, I'm out. If you guys have any questions, let me know. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.